Welcome everybody here on Twitch chats and everybody on YouTube who's watching this video later on over there for some Abzan Citadel. And it looks like I accidentally just clicked off an Oath of Kaya. So that's one second here because it says I have 59 cards. There we go. Now we have 60 cards in the deck again. Okay. So basically we tried Abzan Citadel a few days ago that we didn't have very much success with where we weren't playing the Explore package. Um, and, you know, playing some other things, playing like a Wayward Swordtooth to try to get like the extra lands off the top and stuff like that. Uh, people in chat were saying that I should be playing the Explore package. I was, a, you know, saying that I didn't want to. I was a little frustrated how it wasn't working too well. Slept on it. And yeah, I think we should have the Explore package. So here we go. Um, got that in there. Um, I got a couple of Doom Whispers as well to help uh, surveil off the top of the library if we don't like what cards on top with Bola Citadel. I think Doom Whisperer can do a, a pretty good job there. I <clears throat> I really like playing Abzan with this because I, I think Soren is really important for this deck of like giving our creatures lifelink, you know, giving like this Doom Whisperer lifelink and how we can play it. And it works so well with our two Explorer creatures, the two really important ones with Wild Growth Walker and Jade Light Ranger. You know, if we have a Jade Light Ranger in the graveyard and we have the Wild Growth Walker on the battlefield, we can minus three, bring our Jade Light back so we can gain six life and everything like that. Plus, obviously, our creature's having lifelink. Or, you know, if we need to go grab the Wild Growth Walker so we can have a Wild Growth Walker in play to start gaining life, we can do that also. Um, so, yeah, I love Soren here. And I really like a Johnny here, too. Um, you know, being able to take out gain three life, uh, make our creatures bigger. You know, I think both of these Planeswalkers are pretty nice i could see playing three soren one a johnny you know they, i'm just kind of trying them both out here we got two and two you know we could see how we'd want to necessarily do that um so we'll we'll kind of see what we want to do there but yeah our, our sideboard's still a work in progress and everything but you know we're going to just try to get bola citadel in play and to go crazy and do some crazy stuff so i got a, about an hour and a half to play the deck we're going to uh, play it here in Ranked. Give it a try. And there we go. Yeah, my, my Gruul deck ugh, is a green deck that doesn't play the Explore package. It's possible that deck is better with the Explore package, though. I mean, the Explore package is just awesome. The main reason why it's so awesome is, of course, Jade Light Ranger. It's like just such a great card in, against every deck. Where Wild Growth Walker is, you know, good, you know, great against aggro, but not so good against control. Jaylight Ranger is just so powerful everywhere. Okay, I like our hand because we got the Citadel. I like it. Let's see if we find Wild Growth. All right, Soren. Yeah, let's take Soren. We already got three black sources for the Citadel. Uh, we'll just go Graveyard there. Or I can pick that back up with Soren. Ugh. Hmm. Hmm. I'm Sorin Markov, Lord of Innistroth. <laughs> Time for a drink. I'm gonna go all the way up to six loyalty here. A spellbreaker would be annoying. Okay, or just a lava coil. That's also annoying. That, that helps us keep our life total high, though. I wish you all short lives. Go land. All right, we need another land. Land. 
Um. Really want to cast this finality next turn. Yeah, we played a Grixis Davriel deck yesterday, and um, we had a mono black Davriel deck in the in the comments for the deck as well. Rekindling Phoenix. But yeah, check check out that one on the the YouTube channel, the Grixis Davriel from yesterday. I uh, you know talk a lot about it in there. It went okay. It wasn't like the best Davriel deck. I think I'm just gonna hope they don't have a burn spell in hand. I think that's where I'm at with my life right now. Please don't have a burn spell in hand. Good sign so far. Okay. Really need to hit another land though and get another Jade Light in play. Would have been a lot nicer if we hit another land drop there. that jade light last turn that was disappointing just never could get that sixth mana definitely getting the sothakaya in here and the cast down phoenix is going to be trouble I don't really see anything in particular that's super bad, like the Soren, the Ajani. Like, obviously, how that game turned out, if I would have just taken the land over the Soren, I think we were in a lot better spot. Yeah, we ended up in the top 1,000. So we were good. But yeah, I think Soren and Ajani are like the two cards to kind of take out here. Uh, I don't know which one I do want to take out. Though. It might be Soren. I could just take out one of each. Just go that coward's way out. I'm not taking out Llanowar Elf. Even though it dies to Chain Whirler. I mean, if I do take out Llanowar Elf... I guess I could. All right, if I do, then I'm gonna to have to bring in some Knight of Autumns. Cause Knight of Autumns have a good body. Just you know, they're just four threes. That match, you know, that can block other creatures they have. All right, I'm gonna do that, and I'm gonna bring in the Vivian also to be able to give a creature reach. And I'm taking out one Ajani for that Vivian. So I'm not planning on playing this Wild Growth Walker until turn five when we can go Wild Growth plus Jade Light. We're gonna need uh, lands or explore creatures here. Hey, what's up, Death Barrel? Welcome to the channel. Thanks for that Twitch Prime sub. No, there's no Nexus ban incoming. Unfortunately. Ah, 
I don't really mind Nexus. I don't I don't have anything really against Nexus too much. Alright, we're doing it. Oh, I look forward to seeing you running away. We Ow. are the many. Alright, next turn. Time to start doing it. Yeah, yeah. If that's that's very true. If reclamation was banned, Nexus wouldn't really do very much until rotation, most likely. Hey, Kismet Gaming, welcome to the channel. Enjoy all the emotes. So I'm number eighteen on the day. Two away from hitting another goal. Love it. Love seeing all the hype boats in the chat. Thanks, everybody. Just take it. Twenty-four is still a good amount of life. Right, where's a land? All right, there's a land. And Fear Reaper as well. I do not want those cards. <clears throat> Pick three, we'll play this thing. Fear Reaper sub number 19 on the day. Where's a Wild Growth Walker? Should probably stop before I die. All I have to do is like untap, really. <clears throat> Matthew said, Yeah, <laughs> thanks, Fear Reaper. Yes, yeah, so now we only need one more for our goal. I'm going to say that I'm impressed with both the razor and the shaving cream of Harry's because I have some sensitive skin and it didn't break out, and that's usually why I don't shave. But. I usually cut myself, and this time I didn't do it either. Just a smooth shave. Very nice. All right, defense. 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 All right, we're still at 11. It's usually a little difficult to die from 11. Oh, I'm sorry. Were you doing something? All right, Doom was burr down. Yeah, I want to play this Othakaya on different on like this this thing. If I play Othakaya, though, I don't get to play Jade Light. Love it. Never mind, I get to play Jade Light. All right, back up to 18. 
We got a big wild growth walker. All right, deck did its thing. Time for game three. I'm getting the Selesnia tokens up on YouTube. Nothing to do on turn two. Same as opponent. Four toughness is annoying against with Othakaya. Ow. Life is a lot. So keeping it on top so that to help my Jade Light Ranger become a 4 3. I am really glad those traded. That's a trade I'm very happy for. The heat of your end has arrived! Has it, though? Um... It's fine. A dragon does not lose! I, but you just lost. Hellkite. I'm glad they didn't go haste there. With us having this contempt. Yeah, we finished top thousand. Yeah, I, I like the white. I think the the white adds a lot of good life gain and, and helps you really get to Citadel and stuff. I really like Soren and Johnny with the Kai, like those kind of cards. Growth Chamber Guardian is so perfect here. Honor and courage. Now do you see the benefits of peace? So basically I think we need to have Wild Growth Walker in play. And you know, basically just playing the Ajani also to gain a whole lot of life. You know, Ajani just gained us um, eight life from that attack, three from the tick up, two from the Othakaya. Yeah, you know, that, that thing just gained us so much life that like now is going to allow us to Citadel better. Um, yeah, I'm just going to do it.
We're going down to seven. Next turn, we know we have gain six in our hand here. Is that the last one of those, hopefully? Or the, no, I guess they got one more, don't they? Yep, you got one more. Whew. All right, well, we'll play that. Back down to three. Going down to two. Ah, uh, I can't cast that Wild Growth Walker yet. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, like they're dead. So we're going to gain through the Othakaya, cast the Wild Growth Walker off the top, gain millions and millions of life. But that Ajani did its job. You know, like we ended up there, you know, like we're at like two right there. That Ajani did a really good job of helping us gain that life. I think I am using the, I am using the Contempt card style, aren't I? Pretty positive I am. Don't I have Contempt card style? Yeah. Yeah, we're good. Correct, right, Vale? That's what you get. When you open up your vault, you get one Mythic Wild card, two Rare Wild cards, and three Uncommon Wild cards. If you say it's at 200%, that means you can, ult that means you can open it twice. Yeah, I could definitely do a client restart. It it got it was getting jumpy there. I did a client restart not too long ago. It's just been really bad today. Today's been worse than like other days. Yeah, I feel the Simic mid range is really good, Hubbard. Yeah, I feel it's really good. Uh, the video is up on YouTube, and you can, if you want, you can, uh, you know, go towards like the end of the video if you'd like to kind of hear like my thoughts on it so far. <laughs> Thanks, Nass. I guess my, my camera's a little low. Let me get it up there. Um, I have not played any sealed War of the Sparks. So I don't know too much about it. However, if you go to the Discord channel, uh, there's a room for limited where people have been talking limited, and um, I don't know, my friend Mike is usually in there. Uh, if you look for Ninja Mike, ask him. He he's played tons and tons of sealed. He's probably done like twenty or thirty sealds probably by now. Are you in here watching right now, Mike? I don't know if you're in here. But yeah, do you know? Uh, go in there and and at Ninja Mike. It's like Ninja. And, you know, like once you start typing in Ninja, you'll find him. At him in the limited room and he'll be able to help you out. That thing bouncing skip. my bowl of citadel is annoying. Oh, I've done the hero thing before. Have you? I no, I'm not so sure that you've done the hero thing before, Teferi. I don't know if you're much of a hero. This might be a bad idea. Together we can banish evil from this place. Gosh. I oh, believe in me. you, friend. I wanted to contempt the Teferi, but now I have to contempt that Curse thing. Curse the darkness. Ah, 
I've got time. What is this? All the planeswalkers. Or feast, your blood is mine. I abhor my need for blood. Every planeswalker imaginable. Fast in all your ways. Now, do you see the benefits of peace? <laughs> You're leaving me no choice. A moment. Ow. I will be fine. What a mess I've made. Don't worry, I got this. Okay. Let's see. How our Bola Citadel does. We've already drawn now lots of lands. Gotta have some spells on top. Of peace? Yep, there's a spell. Not bad, not bad. <laughs> Disenchanting the Othakaya. Let's try this. Yep, figured that one. Now here comes Hero back. But we got two multicolor cards out of their hand before they are replaying Hero. That's good. I you know, they didn't back, wait sir, and too. just get the Hero back and then play those during their turn, so they're... I will return, and with more by my side. Love it. Let's look for Wild Growth Walker. No. I'll take the Jade Light. Two, three, four, five. You realize I do not stand alone. Now, do you see the benefits of peace? So that's eight. If I go to six, I could die. Yeah, if I go to six, I could die. Because they have five power on the battlefield, Soren deals one, so they just have a removal spell. They could kill Doom Whisper and kill me if I if I whiff here with the surveil. So I think it's I think I just wait a turn because the Doom Whisper doesn't die. I should be pretty good, you know, Johnny gaining me life and everything like that. Yeah, this Johnny is is just awesome. The art, great. I mean, what a card. We find a wild growth walker, we likely win. Embrace the bloodlust. I've got it. Gives my creature a lifelink. Guess we're going to one. Your death knell. 
Now do you see the benefits of peace? I wish you all short lives. Um, there's no wild growth walker to resurrect, no. There it is. Here we go. There we go. Found it. <clears throat> That's game. We're going to grab another Wild Growth Walker. Oh, man. Dude, the life gain you get. Man, Doom Whisper has been awesome. We're going to be able to soar in and grab back a Merfolk Branch Walker, too. Or I guess we're going to be able to just re-grab a Doom Whisper because we had so much life. Man, now this is a deck. <laughs> this deck is so good. Uh, okay. I liked Othakaya. Honestly, this may not be one where we sideboard, though. I mean, I think I like... Our main deck here. I don't, yeah, I'm not going to sideboard. I like what we got going on here. Yeah, that's all we saw were Hero Precinct 1 Planeswalkers and some removal spells. I don't think the deck really has space for Seeker Squire. You'd probably have to take out like an Othakaya something for it, but I think you need to keep your interaction in. Yeah, Bleeding Black, yep, you can donate. Yeah, I'll build a deck for you based on an idea, absolutely. Yep. Yeah, information about all that down in the donation panel. Um, usually I do like 20 if you have your deck immediately, or uh, 30 for me to build the deck for you. But if you if you go through and, and purchase things for my sponsors you can get it a lot cheaper so you know check out the info panels you can get donation decks um a lot cheaper for doing those or like for example for harry's you can get a donation deck for only ten dollars instead justice. of twenty if you make a three dollar purchase at I harry's lend you my strength so that saves you you can save seven dollars and get yourself a razor starter kit information about all that Do down below me. So I'm trying to incentivize people to make purchases through my sponsors as well. Share in my light. This deck has been fun. I'm definitely glad that we're we are uh, the three colors. I've been really liking a Johnny and Soren in here. Honor and courage. We were not destined to fight. So to keep Gideon alive, they got a block. Which they did. <laughs> I fought worse. Even though that means that's delaying a turn for our Bola Citadel, I think that trading a Land War Elf for a Hero Precinct 1 is a good trade. Oh no, maybe I should maybe I just shouldn't have done that I and just ticked up. Turn. And just gain gain three life and sit back still. Prepare for battle. No, my citadel. <laughs> you fight dirty. Rude.
That'll do. So Othakaya will just kill the deputy. Uh, get me my Doom Whisperer back. And then Your the Wild Growth Walker will kill the Gideon. The no! Oh, what a card. Oh. Well, that's awesome, Rev Daddy. Yeah, looking forward to it. Man, I what a card. That last card being Land Dovin's Veto. Oh, what a killer. Because, yeah, we were going to take out their Deputy and their Gideon and get us Doom Whisperer back. Like, that Kaya was going to be a three for one, basically. It was going to take out all I that will stuff. Lend you my strength. Ugh. Man, that was a killer. I think I want another Othakaya. They got deputy detention. Let's get another one of those in there. I don't have things to cut, though. That's my problem. All, all these cards are good. I like the Bond of Flourishing. Maybe, I guess I can just play two of them, though. For another Kaya. Yeah, I've been pretty impressed with, the, with this deck so far. Yeah, I've been liking it. Wheel. Doom Whisper is good. I'm not going to put all the dress in, but... Maybe I should. I guess I could cut land world for duress. I guess they are just all planeswalkers and then like discard spells and and then if they have Dovin's veto also, maybe I should like honestly, maybe I am boarding wrong. That I should just like replace land world with duress. See that? Well, I'm glad I have the extra Othakai in. I'm not going to play the Doom Whisperer. Even though, like, you know, Doom Whisperer could block the Thief. It uses my mana a lot better, but it's just too risky. Like, they have removal spell. They get to hit me with Thief kind of thing. And then they make me discard my Mortify. And then I'm, like, like really in trouble. Okay, it's it's good, Mitch, and nice. Glad to hear it. Don't you dare. Hooray! No counter spell. Alright, here we go. Here we go. No! The mortify. And here we go again. Here we go again. <laughs> oh, this deck is crazy. Full of Citadel is crazy. All 
All right, and we're starting back up from, you know, we're in platinum now because it, the, it just reset, so we're back in platinum. So we're going back on our road, our road back to mythic. Well, you cannot mortify the Bola Citadel. If that's what you're saying, why did they mortify Wild Growth Walker? Because mortify only destroys enchantments and creatures, no artifacts, and Citadel is an artifact. <laughs> yeah, it's an artifact. Well, they can't. So no, it makes it makes a lot of sense for them to mortify the Wild Growth Walker to keep me from gaining life. If they answer the Wild Growth Walker again, then I'd be able to like resolve a Johnny. Is my thought process there? All right, Johnny still resolves. Hooray! Steadfast in all your ways. Now, do you see the benefits of peace? A familiar taste. Thanks, should minus two. One that grows no sweeter. Ugh. Gosh, Kefnet. Killing me. Killing me, Kefnet. Yeah, who gets to untap with their thing? They get they get to untap with Kefnet before we untap with Doom Whisper, because theirs costs four, ours costs five. I can cast find, get both of my things back. Or I can start really digging towards Citadel. Stop being laggy. Come on. Why is it? It's like this today. Okay. We get to resolve the Citadel, and Grixis doesn't usually have an answer to an artifacts, so... see if we can uh, do some crazy stuff with it. We have the Bond of Flourishing also to help us out. Ah! Both Contempts down there. I do is just untap with the citadel and here we go I did not start this fight but I will finish it grab this back get rid of the citadel body, here not your soul um I don't want to play I think I'll just wait on this Soren
We'll let this Soren die, and then we got the next one. Give all of our creatures lifelink and everything. Rot in my wake. Wow, talk about power. I think this deck has some power. <laughs> just play every yeah, does you just play your whole deck? Is it just frenzy? <laughs> yeah, is this cheating? It seems like it, right? <laughs> we just get to play every single card off the top of our deck, infinitely. Let's get that lifelink in. Hollow with scorn for you. <laughs> what happens when you pass and they board wipe you? Well, they, you don't pass, you just kill them. You could also Citadel, you could activate the Citadel and sack your 10 non land permanents and make them lose 10 life, kind of thing. deck is sweet. Dude, Soren and Ajani, I, like, I'm really glad that we're not green-black, that we're Abzan. These Sorens and Ajani's are awesome. Alright, Othakai doesn't really kill a lot of things in their deck. I guess they could have Thieva Sanity. Whoa, Bert! With the Pog, cheers. Thank you, Bert. Oh yeah, they have all those bedevils now. Yeah, bedevil is going to be a thing. I guess I need all these duresses, don't I? And I guess I should be playing Harpooner. I want Vivian, and I want Vivian, and I want Harpooners. I mean, I want a lot of things. I guess I don't want Othakaya. Um, gosh, I, get, I don't know what else to take. Like, how do I take out six? How do I take out all these cards? I guess I'm going to take out a Johnny's. Um... I guess I'm taking out Llanowar Elves. So we can kind of play a little bit slower game. And I'm playing two Harpooners. Yeah, breaking standard already. Yeah, that is true. You can cast a second Citadel with one on the stack and then activate the first one. If you have your 10 non-land permanents and everything. Yep, you can sure do that. Gonna take the combo card or the duress? Do I let them unmoor ego my citadels? I think I do.
playing the lands they know about. Even though it's not, you know, double green. Yeah, like, while they worry about my Citadel, I'm just going to be killing them with these things. They just exiled one? Oh, come on, opponent. I am Soren Markov, Lord of Innistrad. Man, Soren plus Kral Harpooner is pretty sweet. Killing the branch walker. I can rebuild. No, no, not that one. This one. Not real. You belong to me now. Mm, I don't think we need that yet. All right, three and O with Bola Citadel. Yeah, loving the Soren here. Given our creatures' lifelink, probably only have time for one more match before I gotta go. Ugh. So here we go. Let's go final boss playlist. Cuz I am I'm doing the early stream today here. I went from noon to 7 Eastern. Cuz I'm going to go see the um I feel like we played this person yesterday. Going to go see the new Avengers movie. So I got to go. Walker. Yeah, someone's cool. Against blue black dot deck. I am not going to sit this one out. Here goes nothing. Can you though? Can you just sit it out? I wouldn't mind if you sat it, sat it out. Thanks, Bert. Trust me, I have a plan. So we're gonna have Thought Erasure and Draw Step. Nope, no Thought Erasure here. Okay, well let's just go ahead and go to attacks. See what happens. It's only a matter of time. Okay, that happened. I'm just going Kaya's Wrath during my turn. It's kind of ridiculous. Kai's right there, untap into the fairy. That's ridiculous. Yeah, I'm gonna go after this. Um, after this match. <laughs> this will be child. I'm really I'll be back. back. I beat me this time. Just you wait. Well, that does make my Soren worse. Where's the Citadel? Esper does not have a lot of answers to artifacts. Either. You know, it's like the Teferis are about it. 
Jeez. The undead make great men from battle. All right, to come the on, grave. Citadel. Come on, Citadel. Be gone. I won't forget hmm. this. I'm gonna make myself scarce. Hmm. Yeah, we got enough black sources. We're good there. There's one card down. But now our opponent knows about it. They could have a counter spell. Hopefully not. This looks like a fun new toy. Hurry! Hopefully not. And their their hand's been really incredible with all these planeswalkers and the Kai's wrath. Watch your back from here on out. Turn three to fairy. Turn four turn. wrath. Ugh. And then all these other things. So here we go. Please no counter. Just need that previous turn. Get to just draw more cards with Oleana, man. We are in huge trouble. I'll find a use for you later. I'm giving us one Let's more draw step to, to see if we top deck another Citadel. If our Citadel is just one card higher than what it was. I think we, you know, we actually have like a chance here. There's just like one card higher. Was that to you? You beat me. Here? I'm gonna make myself scared. Bravo. Yeah, new Liliana's crazy good. Odakai's great. Good Fairy's great. Easy to find Esper gained more. so many cards in the last set. No, Liliana's not going to see play in modern, no. At six, six mana? No, it won't. Alright, my cyborg walkers coming on in. A Johnny out. Usually I take out Wild Growth Walker in this matchup, but I feel like we need Wild Growth Walker. Yeah, let's do this. Cool. I, I don't have any plans for the weekend. Just streaming here. That's all we're doing, Boot. Uh, Saturday, we're doing the sub-battle day. But yeah, if you want to head on, head on over here for the weekend, Boot, definitely. My sideboard, you know, still a work in, in progress. It's possible I need, I should just have like more anti-control stuff in my sideboard than what I have. It's possible that like our main deck is just going to be good enough against like aggro, and we can really have a sideboard tuned at beating the the blue deck's control and reclamation. Dang. Double Mortify. Kai's Wrath, Thought Erasure, Teferi. I, I think I'm taking the Thought Erasure. To 
help protect my hand. Ugh. There goes my Mortify down to the bottom, like my one removal spell for that thief. Very good. Give us another turn. We need two more to get to the Citadel. There we go. Get another one. One more. Pass. Go to discard. Alright, we did it. wasn't meant to be contained. You need to be I've seen down. things that would break And uh, Vivian, like of course, you. is awesome with the Citadel Show no of, mercy. like, resetting the library. You know, like, when we with the tick up and everything. No one knows the wilds like I do. Hmm. Dovin's veto. My crew is the finest in the seas. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And So they did bring in Thief of Sanity. I'm going to replace three elves with three harpooners. All right, game three. All right, we got a pretty good looking one here. Uh, do I want to take Teferi, Hero, Dominaria, or search for Ascanta? It's one of these two. I guess I'll just take the Ascanta for now. Oh, right. They didn't have black mana? I thought... Oh, well. I should have made my decision easier. I want the three power creature, you know, to, to pressure them. I'm going to be attacking for three every turn, not attacking for one every turn. Seems like our opponent may need more lands. Just twice in a row, they're keeping like a two-lander and just sitting on two lands now. We can deal with Search easier than Teferi, but it was just a, a long time before the Teferi. Our opponent doesn't look so happy.
If they just like concede here, which is looking like they may just be doing. I think we'll actually have time for one more match. Yeah, we'll have time for another match. This match ends here. Let's get more power on the battlefield. Uh, I was hoping that was going to be another 3 2. Well, this game may take 10 minutes if they just wait till the rope runs out on them every single turn. Looks like they are pretty upset right now. Well, I was hoping it was going to be a 3-2. You know, not a 2-1. Obviously, a 2-1 doesn't have more power than a 2-4. Huh. Well, now they have the possibility of... Get that out of their hand. Now they have a possibility of a Wrath next turn. If they have the Wrath next turn, then we get to play Teferi. Or sorry, we get to play Doom Whisperer. No Wrath. They got Contempt. Yeah. Take that to Fairy, please. Thank you. Gave my cards out of my hand anyway because of Thought Erasure. So, like, even if they have. Hmm. I was thinking they may have Absorb, I guess. Yeah, I think it's still worth it playing that. Alright. Let's find something. Set up our next draw step Planeswalker or Bola Citadel. That's all I'm taking. Let's thin the deck. I'm just going to go back to the regular playlist. Um, I mean, another Doom Whisperer wouldn't be bad either. Uh, PayPal or with the bits. You can donate with, with the bits here on Twitch. Also. Or again, if you're interested in a donation deck, um, you can, if not those work for you, you can make a purchase through one of the sponsors to get donation decks as well. Uh, you know, there's lots of information. Yeah, check out the info panels about how all that works. All right, four and O. Oh. Let's 
Let's crack a pack open to celebrate that. 4-0. Oh, we got a blast zone. Very nice, very nice. Okay. GG's. That game did take like another 10 minutes. If if we would have just ended that that one, the, the 10 minutes previous would have ended it. But yeah, Abzan Citadel feels pretty good. Feel, this definitely feels like a, a real deck here. Um, so yeah, I'm wondering if sideboard, maybe I can, maybe I, I don't need three Harpooner, one cast down, one Othakaya. I don't know, our mono blue matchup's a little tough. And you know, maybe, so maybe I can have a little bit more against control. But it seemed like we had a, a good amount of cards there after sideboarding. I mean, I, I love this three mana Vivian. Kind of want to play more of those. It's possible I should take out Frasca and have another three, another one of these three mana Vivians. This card's so good, and, and it only costs three mana instead of six. Honestly, Big Liliana. Um, Big Liliana could be maybe a better option than this Frasca also. But yeah, explore stuff is so powerful, especially with Bola Citadel. Y'all got to see that. We just got to do so many crazy things with this deck. Um, yeah. So yeah, that's Abzan Citadel. Uh, if you're watching this video later on YouTube, I uh, hope you you know try out the deck, uh, see if you like it, all that kind of stuff. Thank you so much for watching.